down to day one of weekend one of Summerfest. Carol Meekins is there and you are overseeing it all from your perch, Carol. <laughs> yeah, I am very lucky because the weather is so beautiful. And as you know, Steve, Don Somali retires next year and Sarah Smith Pankeri will take the helm as CEO and president of Summerfest. I sat down with Pankeri Smith this morning before the gates open and she talked about why Summerfest is such a great community asset. Summerfest is back and the upcoming CEO and President Sarah Smith Pankeri is thrilled. This is our first Summerfest in the summer in two years. You know, it is so exciting for the entire team. We're so excited to be back in summer. You can hear the music starting up all around us. Um, and it really, to bring, the, to bring the festival back to the community over three weekends in summer just means the world to our team. Pankeri is personally proud that Summerfest works hard at inclusion. The fact that we have a beautiful new Northwestern Mutual Community Park with an accessible playground. I mean, Carol, as, as, the, as the mother of, of children who enjoy playing on that playground, it is just, it's an incredible asset to our community and one that we're excited to open not only for the festivals, but throughout the entire summer. She says spreading the festival out will give Summerfest a chance to reach more music lovers. More and more have people come from across the country to attend Summerfest. And so that weekend model really allows uh, more people to come over the weekends that maybe not are not from Milwaukee. Pankeri takes pride in the tradition of Summerfest supporting local agencies like the Hunger Task Force, United Way, and Nextdoor Foundation, as well as hundreds of other local nonprofits. So you and I were footing it for Family Health 20 yes. years oh, ago, right. remember? Yeah, we so, you know, it's just, it's, it's who we are, and it's, and I'm so um, proud that I've been raised in a community where, where that's encouraged and, and that something will absolutely continue well in the future. And it definitely will. Now, of course, we all know about some high profile cancellations like Justin Bieber and Ann Wilson from Heart. But Pan Carey says we are going to be just fine. She tells me her team is flexible and they are able to take on challenges, any challenges that come their way. Now, also a reminder, we want to let you know you can get into the big gig for free tomorrow. This is all thanks to a partnership between Summerfest, Lou Malnati's, and TMJ4. Children's Fest is arriving. If you arrive between noon and 3, you will not have to pay admission, and there's going to be discounts on food and drinks. Children's Fest is always a great time. Brian is back with more on our fabulous forecast.